Hi everyone, welcome back to this channel. In this video lesson, we will create our first route and controller. This is to put you on the right track to create our job portal application. Without wasting time, let's begin. So, in our app.js file, let's create our first route. App.get as you can see. Okay. App.get. And the first parameter will be the route. And after that, we'll add a request response. That accept, I mean, the second parameter is an our function request response. And we will send to the front end. Where's that send? And our message would be um, hello from the JS. And we save. And now let's let's take a look in our browser. So our backend port is nine thousand. Okay, and press enter. As you can see, hello from the JS. Now let's go back again to our code editor. We have more things to do. And as you can see in the console, 200. Okay, this is possible with Morgan. And now if we were to put um, all our, our code in app.js, it would be messy. So we will structure our folders. Okay, we comment this and we will create, I mean, a new folder named routes. Okay, all our routes will be in our routes folder and let's create a um, A no file inside of it. Let's name it of routes.js. And as you can see, we have our file. And now we're gonna need express, const express, require express. We will create a new variable name um water equal so we're gonna take um the express okay equal okay cause water equal express that water don't forget that it will be with capital r like so And let's create our wow. Wow to that yet. Okay, and the second parameter. So we paste um, what we have just copied from app.js. Okay. And after that, we need to export water in order to use it in other files. Module that exports equal water and save. Now, instead of using like so in app.js, we're going to use Wout's middleware. Okay, I'm gonna leave this for you guys. This comment. And we're gonna use um what middleware. To do so, we're gonna type up that use. 
inside of it will be our route okay and we will receive i mean the this file so we will need to import it from um routes folder let's import i mean routes this is here we will import all the routes and let's name it um, cons of routes equal require okay dot slash okay as you can see routes forward slash enter of routes and let's copy of words to put it in our words middleware like so comma and save as you can see no errors and let's go back to um, our browser let's try try to reload okay same result and uh, let's go back in our code editor as you can see in the console nothing changed okay so also you need to um, learn about status code it's it's very important okay so we don't have any errors but also um, we have to do other things because um, we will also leave all the words here and we will put, we will put the logic in controllers folder to do so um i'm going to create another folder named controllers okay our folder is created and let's navigate inside of it cd change directory controllers and let's create another file name of controller that js It has been created, and um, inside of it, okay, exports. I'm gonna name this controller sign in. This is just an example to show you how we will structure because we will use um, MVC pattern model view controller. Okay, so now exports that sign in, okay, the same thing. Um, okay, and now we're gonna save. Okay, and now we go. We're gonna go back. Let's copy this. We're gonna go back in routes. Okay. Okay, as you can see, already appear and auto import it, like like so, like you can see in the screen, and save. So let's go back to um, our browser and if we refresh again, okay, same result, no errors. Okay, let's go back to our code editor and as you can see, um, nothing changed, okay. Okay, but last details. So all our APIs will have a prefix of API, okay? And uh, let's add API in the browser and press enter. As you can see, same result. As you can see, we have two hundred has status code in the console that means successful response so in the next video we'll get our hands dirty and the video will be much longer so that was it for this lesson so if you have comments um, use the comment section if you like this video please leave a thumbs up and uh, don't forget to share it to your friend so that more people can watch our videos with that being said 
Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.